Hello everyone, Andreas here. This is already part 10 of my robot arm project and you're here with my, let's say, robot family. Um, with all the robots and robot stuff I built the last couple of months. Um, you see the first version here and then the second version. And then I spent a lot of time to build the third version with a 3D printed harmonic drive. This didn't work out. It's based on this uh, three of these elements and they have a 3D printed harmonic drive inside and a DC motor with an encoder on the back. I will uh, come to this uh, at another point. But uh, the conclusion is it didn't work. So I was a little bit frustrated and started rethinking about the whole robot arm project. And so I did a lot of research and what I came up with uh, was uh, I will use stepper motors again. Because if you crank them up to 24 volts or more, they're quite uh, strong and fast. And much, much easier to control than uh, the DC motors. Uh, unfortunately, they, also, uh, they still did not provide enough torque to use them directly and I did not longer use uh, want to use gearboxes because they are expensive and hard to find and also you have a lot of problems with the scoop and backlatch. So um, I came up with a two-stage two uh, timing belt solution. And this is the version 4 of my robot arm. You also see the computer models here. It's not fully printed yet because I have a little bit trouble with my printer. So I spend a lot of time working on my printers. But it's a more or less functional prototype this time. I started working from the top to the bottom. So the uh, top, uh, the, the Extra and the last joints are done now, and I'm still working on this design for uh, for this part. But um, I think I move it a little bit. It's quite strong, it, uh, this unit weighs about one kilogram or even more. Let's check it. It's 1.4 kilogram and it's rotating without any, pr you have seen it. And this will be attached something like this. This is also my entry video for the Hacker Day semi-finals. Um, with this video I post all the design files uh, on GitHub from all the three uh, four robot arms. So you can edit them. I'm mm, reducing the, uh, my project a little bit to just build a hardware platform and also using stepper motors. My goal is it to create a robot arm that can lift about one to two kilograms and position it accurately so I can build my own mini production factory in the basement. I have a few ideas um, but I want to produce a semi-automated and for that I need a, a robot and I also think the maker community needs a robot to produce stuff. I keep you updated and if you like, are interested in supporting me, uh, you can contact me over uh, the Hacker Day site or also the YouTube comments. Thank you very much for watching. See you next time. Bye.